Okay, talking of risk management when you take trade. Let's say this one. Um, or is that... Um, all right, when you take trade, see to it that before you enter the trade, the trend is not after the take profit one. So... Uh, 0 0.72087 0 uh, okay yeah. oh this AUD USD um, yeah let's say euro USD okay so 18469 all right so 18469 so 18469 Meaning, let's look for the one eight four six nine. There. So, meaning, okay. Um, it doesn't matter if you are late with 30 minutes or one hour. Okay, so let me just um, uh, I'll give you an, I'll give you the logic of it. Okay. So this means that. there so let's say the entry is here okay or wh wherever the entry is here okay that the trader expects that our, our profit one is here meaning if the trend goes here so you have to be careful with your lot size with the amount um balance that you have make sure that let's say it doesn't go this way even if it goes this way okay your account can still sustain okay the the, the trade so let's say you're losing for a certain amount which is not um permanent so it's temporary then 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 maybe later on it will go back again and then when so this is what you call the risk management factor, so money management. So make sure when you put a lot size, okay, it will sustain whether it, it will become or, or it will hit take profit or it will go beyond beyond this point where the probability of the of the stop loss where you should put a stop loss here, here or or here. Okay, so in this particular um, signal so it's gonna go here TP1 and then maybe take profit 2 or, or 3 here right so for now always take the take profit 1 um, trade okay so that's how that's how basically they, they did this okay they're expecting the trade to go here since if you're gonna see the chart so it's more on the buy trend okay so they choose to enter here and then TP here so your question with um, is it real time so it depends all right so I would not suggest so it's up to you so maybe if you see that the trade is you were late maybe four hours five hours and it's already here maybe you just have to wait for a little bit or don't trade at all don't rush to trade okay um, don't trade if you're in doubt okay at least you see the the bigger probability when you trade so that's why it's very important to to learn at least the basic the fundamentals chart reading and risk management most importantly chart reading and risk management okay so how uh, what's the lot that you're gonna put um, how much risk do you want to make 
so it's up to you so there so at least if you want to to be a conservative like uh, you make little by little at least better than than losing control your lot size right if your account is five hundred dollars or below maybe play with two to five lot size or two to four lot size 0.02 to 0.04 I mean if your account is 500 and up at least you play with 0.05 to 0.08 kind of like that so your account is in the less risk in case it loses okay you still have the big chance to recover okay so it's all it's all about time and price time and price if you lose meaning you lose the time and you will have to to invest again with time on how long will you recover the losses so winning little by little in forex is better than winning big okay as long as it's, as long as it's long term okay that's the idea of it so take profit let's say the number here on the right and then stop loss on here so that's how they make and then they read the chart okay that's how you manage your money in forex thank you